I'm Molly Mahoney, and I'm your host for Raw Orange County. Tex, and this is White Lightning, and we're the kids in the trees. Uh, we're excited. We're about to play a set at the uh, Raw Artists of Orange County event, Marvel. We're a four-piece band. The bass player and drummer don't fit, don't like to be in front of a camera, but uh, <laughs> well, that's what they get for not showing up. Um, me and White Lightning formed this band. We've been writing music for a couple of years. He's my best friend here, and uh, we found those guys recently. And uh, wh Why don't you talk to him about how bad it had to suck, because he taught me how to play the guitar a lot, and when I was first starting, how bad it was, you know, just to have to listen to me. <laughs> yeah, actually, Nick's come a long way in the, uh, the past couple of years that he's been playing. Uh, we actually met at a Christian uh, rehab where... Uh, both kind of led the wrong kind of lives for a while there, and we turned it around, and now we, we pour all our uh, hearts into the music, try to write inspirational music. Um, our style, uh, we like to think of ourselves kind of stealing some reggae from Sublime and then uh, mixing it in with uh, the blues that you, that you hear in the Black Keys. There's a song by a band called Need to Breathe, who's one of our favorites, and it's called The Outsiders. And when I think I could speak for him as well, when we listen to that song, we relate because we are the outsiders. But when we're playing music, nothing matters, you know? Uh, uh, how much money we don't have, you know? How uh, our girlfriends are mad at us, or, well, by the way, neither one of us have any anymore. Um, you know, all the things that are troubling you in life, you start, we start jamming and that stuff goes away. And it's like therapy for us almost. But uh, since I started playing the guitar, it just kind of made sense and nothing else, you know, that's that's it. Music's pretty much, that's, that's my number one. band's kind of a, a cool story for me at least. Uh, I'm a big fan of the band uh, Dispatch. They're an East Coast band. They're independent. They never signed to any labels. They just toured a lot. and they, they wrote a lot of cool albums and they're kind of like a reggae style. But anyways, they did a, a big show in, in Boston in a, in a park. It was a free show. And like 100,000 people showed up. It was just packed. And there was these kids that climbed up into the trees because they were just trying to get a view. They were just trying to hear and just see the stage from from up there in the trees. And the one of the, I think the drummer before one of the songs, he he was he saw them and he was like, yeah, this song goes out to kids to the kids in the trees. So I was like, it just hit me that uh, there's a cool name for a, for a band. It's like a metaphor, I guess. 
kind of we are the kids in the trees and we, the the yeah tree. just trying to get a glimpse yeah so uh well we're in the process of trying to do a lot of recording uh the drummer and bass we have now they're both new so we've been going through the process of just teaching them our songs and uh, they've been adding their style to it you know and helping making it complete so now i feel like we've got a lot of songs down we're starting to get to the recording uh, we do have one song recorded that him and I recorded in a studio, kind of give somebody an idea if they want to check us out online. You can find that on our Facebook, uh, Kids in the Trees, or we've got a Reverb Nation as well, uh, the Kids in the Trees. Uh, but uh, we're going to be adding some more real soon, so uh, look for those for sure. We, we are, are the Kids in the Trees, and we, we are, are raw, raw artists. artists.